see for the part of the day. Yeah. Yeah. Nice to have the sun. We'll get a little bit tomorrow too, but also some snow showers in between there. So it's uh, more typical with the cold flow off of Lake Mission kind of a thing here. Uh, that's the lake effect snow. Little bits and pieces here around and south of I-94. Not much, right? But if you slide a little farther to the north, remember some of the blue things that we highlight here are the heavier bouts of snow. So coming out of Brandon and uh, Bruce Township, working their way uh, through Macomb County here from northwest to southeast. Popping pretty good around Leonard down here toward Warren, Sterling Heights, toward Mount Clemens eventually as well. And then also in central St. Clair County, heading down toward Algonac and East China as it moves again to the southeast. A little lighter out in Livingston County around Heartland, Highland, out toward Fowlerville. There's certainly more to come, and you can see the connection. These are just growing literally on top of the lake and then moving on shore here. That's the way it works when we get the colder air over the warm waters, and the waters are still very, very warm uh, for the second week of February here. So looking ahead now, we'll have scattered action around this evening tonight and maybe tomorrow, but this is Sunday, 8 o'clock in the morning. Might start with a peak of sunshine. It won't last too much. Clouds start rolling in here in the afternoon, especially after 2 o'clock. We start to pick up the snow. Looks like late afternoon and uh, early to mid evening will be the heaviest pace in terms of how it's coming down. And then it scoots out of here around midnight or shortly after that. So we'll have a little bit for a while and then a little more than a little bit to finish off the weekend. So maybe a couple spots get up to a half an inch out there this evening with the hit and miss action. It should be a little bit more intense overnight. So maybe some spots go as much as an inch. That's not everywhere either. So this is the snow shower action, but then it's widespread snow coming in Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening. We're looking somewhere around one to three inches by the time we get to about midnight or so. So finishing the weekend uh, with some widespread snow, but it's done early enough that the road should get cleaned up uh, by Monday morning. This evening, scattered snow. Watch out for some slippery spots on the roads, mid 20s. There's not much change here for Saturday, upper 20s for a high. Very few uh, snow showers there, so mostly in pretty good shape for the roads, but it gets worse as we get into Sunday afternoon, especially into Sunday evening, even though temperatures come up. I think the snow is pretty persistent. We're around freezing now, a couple degrees either side. It'll drop off, though, and it feels colder because the wind, most wind chills down in the mid 20s. We'll go to 19 tonight, snow showers scattered, maybe a few tomorrow, but some peaks of sun as well. 28 for the high, then 35 on Sunday. 37 Monday and Tuesday and Wednesday. So a chance to thaw a little bit there. But again, Sunday night into Sunday evening, some 